I was out here. I don't know how long it's been out here, but her computer's out here, so I'm guessing she <laughs> was doing school out here. I'm going to put this away because if a storm comes, it's going to get really wet. Thank you. Uh -huh. Hello, good morning. Tim, it's been a rough night. Oh, yeah. I thought yesterday was a rough night. Well, shit. And I came on this live yesterday morning and I was like, my fucking kids are fucking killing me, bitch. No. Yesterday was even worse, and again, can't blame the husband, you can't blame the kids. I went to sleep at 12. We went to sleep at 12. By the time we got off the video, um, it was like 11. Me and Ryan were uh, talking over things, doing some things, and then um, we went, we started going to bed, and it was like 12 when we went to bed. Um, this necklace is not about to last any longer. My, one of my followers gave it to me for my birthday, but you could tell that it's like, it's missing. You see right here? Mm -hmm. It's missing that little clamp now. Mm -hmm. So one of these days is just going to go through. But she gave it to me and I've been wearing it every single day since. <laughs> you haven't taken it off. I haven't taken it off at all. I never really get gifts from you guys. That's why. <laughs> So when she gave it to me on my birthday, I was like, oh my God, thank you so much. <laughs> it says, I love you more. And this one says, love always and forever. Uh, um, yeah, it's so cute. So um, I think this is about to break. <laughs> I can see it. it sucks. Um, I love you, friend. Gla uh, Yessie, are, are, you, um, are you ready to turn up, bitch? Oh no, my things are all broken too. Is she going to... Um Rosarito. Yeah, she's going to Rosarito. Oh, fuck. I'm like, you better get those booty shaking ready because I don't want to pay for nothing. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, but yeah, so fucking, uh, we go to sleep at 12 and uh, my baby girl wakes up and she thinks it's time to play. So I was like, all right, let's let, let her play. All right, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, got the little So I let her play, whatever. And Ryan's like, I need, um, I'm going to take a shower. And I'm like, all right, cool. And I started patting her, trying to put her to bed manually, whatever, like, 30 fucking minutes, 45 minutes later, Ryan comes out of the shower. She's still up playing. I'm like, oh my fucking God. I'm like, all right, let's go. Um, she started to get a little, uh, <laughs> she's peeking. You see her little head right there? Look at her little head. How is she that tall? <laughs> you can't see her now. Um, she finally went to sleep for like, I want to say like 30 minutes and she woke up again. I keep meaning. Go to bed. And I keep meaning. <laughs> she thinks it's fucking funny. I'm ready, bitch. I know, right? It's going to be turned up. We're going to be like. <laughs> Ryan's like, don't do that. Mm -hmm. Ryan pulls me by my hair. We start fighting. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um. Yeah, so uh, that, it happened the whole night. I think she woke up like four, five times at nighttime. <sighs> in the morning, I thought maybe she's going to sleep in, you know. No, she fucking woke up. The back of my hair, I could sleep like that. Like my face and my pillow, I sleep like that. She was pulling them. I found hair in my bed, bitch. Look, ya no tengo nada. I'm fucking balding. Do you see it? <laughs> Do you see this? It's a whole, it's a whole, this is a whole ass section, bitch. <laughs> I, I am, I am so, so sad. <laughs> and I'm screaming to Ryan like, she's pulling my hair, just get her. So I told Ryan like, go down. I always let you sleep in. I'm like, you better let me sleep in today. He takes the babies down, makes them breakfast. I come down, like, I don't know how long it was while I was asleep. I come down at nine. And I'm just like, tonight we fucking going out. We're going to the strip club. I don't give a fuck. I'm like, I'm not doing this. I don't, want, I don't want to do this. I'm like, no breakfast today either. I told the kids. I'm like, here, here's a sopa. 
Well, the, the babies, they have to have their eggs. Ryan made the baby's eggs. But the bigs, they, when we got, when we were going back in after the live, last night, they were still up. And the bigs, if they're not awake in the morning, it's really hard because the littles are like, wants attention, they want to play. And when the bigs are awake, they're like, they're playing with the kids. Everybody's like running around the house and it's easy for me and Ryan to brush our teeth because they're playing with them, you know? But if the bigs are not awake, oh, hell no, bitch. It's game over. I go to the bathroom. My daughter would throw herself and cry. I'm like, for fucking why? It's so intense. It's so intense to cry. Like, it's like she just, you just abandon her. It's like as if you dropped her off of the fucking fire station and walked out. That's how fucking the cry sounds like. I'm like, fuck. Yeah. Like that shit. We're going to do a smoke break. Sorry. You're like, smoking already? I'm like, ah. I'm like, sorry, I'm, we're stressed parents. <laughs> we're a little stressed. This one looks like it's dipped in cocaine. Look at it. I don't know if it's dipped in cocaine or that shit is expired. <laughs> it's a little expired. It's a little expired. I'm like, how old is that blood? <laughs> it's all hard to suck. <laughs> this one, um, Alex from Lorella gave it to us. <laughs> He did. Don't be lying. It was him. It was him. I was like, you got some weed? And he's like, yeah, what you need? And I was like, just anything, any pre-rolls. And then he's like, let me tell the girls in the back. <laughs> he went to go tell the girls in the, the shipping team. And the shipping team went to the dispensary. And they, they got us this one. And his shipping team smokes, not him, though. What? I said his shipping team smokes, not him, though. Yeah, everyone knows he doesn't smoke. I told him he should start smoking. Going 100 miles an hour. Smoke I'm like, you need to fucking smoke. Come the fuck down, sir. I didn't see what Alexandra said. <laughs> Was she talking about my ass and my anus? Did you find these things? You can't talk shit about me when I smoke like this. I'm really fancy. No. <coughs> Jesse, I wish you were fucking my neighbor. I'm <coughs> you wish you were my neighbor too, bitch. He has it all hooked up in the back. <laughs> <coughs> oh, yeah. got a nice ass spot. The backyard? Bitch. <coughs> My backyard ain't shit, girl, compared to his backyard. Our backyard. I'm going to I'm going to uh I'm going to go by the fence right here and I'm going to show you his backyard. He has a whole baseball fucking cage, but it's nice. Back there is nice. You got shade. Um, my backyard all plain. <laughs> I'm like, what is that basket of laundry doing out here? Just kidding. We put towels right there for the kids um like that shit up i know right fuck it's been a hard honestly we're running on like three hours of sleep <coughs> three hours of sleep thank god for a fucking key tool because without this bitch what? don't call cps on me but without this but not three hours straight cause... mm -mm. so i'm like tonight i want to go out i'm like i don't give a fuck where i go i don't give a fuck if i go to the park bitch i don't give a fuck I would just want to fucking go out. <laughs> There's the times that you, you're like that. I'm like, I love my kids dearly. Don't get me wrong. I fucking love them. <coughs> but mama needs to have a life too, Jody. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Dude, I want to watch Jody. They should do. They should do a drive. Uh, yeah, drive drive in. But like old school gangster uh, movies and have everybody smoke and drink their little oh, 40s with the fucking paper wrap. And that'd be vibes. I do it. I rent it. I do a meet and greet like that. I'm just gonna. You should. <laughs> okay. I'm like driving. Here's the deal. Hit this shit because it's fucking strong. <laughs> Somebody get your friend. She dying. <coughs> I throw up. <coughs> it's strong. It's fucking strong. <coughs> <coughs> Somebody help. Somebody help. I can't. I'm out. I'm out. Oh, look at my eyes. I'm fucking wide. How many hits did I take? Like two? Fucking pussy ass bitch. 
Uh, that shit's strong. <clears throat> Remember? Remember what she said? Yeah, you're not going to fucking finish it. She told us, you're not going to fucking finish it. I'm like, bitch, I'll finish it right here, right now. I fucking told her. I'm like, over here talking shit. I'm like, bitch, I took three hits. I took three hits. I'm dying. This shit is liquidy. You see how glossy it is? Fucking glossy. Looks like... It looks like a good morning. <sighs> I'm so... <coughs> You can't even ash it. It's so fucking thick still. It's not even ash. It's probably still weed. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's like honey. It's like dripping. Oh, like Fuck that shit. Yeah, but like I was saying yesterday, I, I had the same morning. I thought yesterday's morning was bad. <coughs> <coughs> um... And I was saying on the morning yesterday, like, you can't, like, you can't blame your kids for anything, you know? Well, society says you can't. Bitch, in my head, I'm like, what the hell is happening? Yesterday, I woke up, Debbie had toilet paper all over the living room. And my daughter posted up right there laying on the couch with her phone. I'm like, in my head, I'm like, oh my fucking God what the fuck and you know and i feel like my mom she would have straight up my mom would have grabbed my ass by my hair she would have said that and i would have been like i'll, I'll stop crying not even knowing what the fuck happened <laughs> not even understanding what she's saying because i'm like i don't know spanish so um i took back a moment and i was like obviously um i'm not gonna be like what the fuck what? look at him he's doing all the toilet paper you know I was just like <clears throat> clearing my throat, trying to hold back these demons of my mom, trying to come back and like abuse my a kids. So I'm just like, <clears throat> I'm like, Duffy. And I try to make it into a joke, bitch. I'm like, Duffy, no, Duffy, no. And then I'm like, stop, put it down. And I'm trying to be really patient. And my daughter thinks it's funny. She starts looking at him and he keeps doing it. He's like, no. And he keeps doing it and he keeps unrolling it even faster in front of me. And I'm like, fuck. In my head, I'm like, ooh, this fool's fucking testing me. I'm like, ooh, this little punk wanna go. I'm like, he's feeling froggy. He is feeling froggy. And I'm like, okay, and let me calm the fuck down. And slowly the anger of my daughter just watching him is building up too. I'm like, why is she why does she just like get up and be like, no, 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 mom said no, you know, and like take it away? She's laughing with him. <clears throat> So I walk towards up to them and I'm like, I take it from him. And I was like, no, throws himself on the floor, fucking starts screaming and crying. I'm like three hours of sleep. I'm like, I'm going to fucking lose it. My, I told my daughter, <clears throat> give me your phone because you're not going to use it today. And she's like, why? And I'm like, Debbie just wasted a whole toilet paper roll in front of you. And I clearly asked you watch Dovey. I'm just going to change and brush my teeth. It takes me like 15 minutes in the morning to just brush my teeth, change, weigh myself, do my little morning video, like, a, like my Instagram. And then I'll be downstairs like in 15 minutes and she'll be playing with them. And I'm like, and this is what happens under your watch. Girl, if it was my mom, she wouldn't even explain why she was taking my phone. She would slap me for questioning her. <laughs> like what? Oh, you want to talk back? <laughs> She's asking why. <laughs> and my daughter would be like, why? But why? My son too. But why? I'm like, oh my God. That already is rude. That already is fucking rude. <clears throat> oh, baby. Yeah. The why would get you smacked up for shit. The why will get you smacked up for sure. No doubt. Co comment down below if you don't feel this like the same way. The why. Just the why. When we these were kids. kids. But these kids. Today, these kids nowadays, they'll question you. And then you'll start getting so crazy in your head that you'll start questioning yourself. I need to get a, a Kleenex. <clears throat> You start questioning yourself. You start questioning your worth, bitch. What? That's stupid. You start developing PTSD. It's I crazy. know. As a fucking parent. The rules today are different than the rules when we were kids.
Thank God for Sophia too, baby. I know she helps a lot. I know she's been so helpful. My niece has been staying with us, and oh my God, she's so helpful. And she, she's for sure destined to be a mom. When we go in the car, she reminds everybody, "Do you have your seatbelt on?" And my kids, they don't check she's on each other. They don't check on each other. They don't check like, "Oh, mom, she doesn't have her seatbelt on." No, they don't. Nobody says anything. I usually go back and just check or I'll say, "Put your seatbelt on." And um, <clears throat> leave it as that. And she literally, she has um, habits of a uh, good mom, I feel like. And she wants to be a mom. She tells us when she grows up, she wants to be a mom. I was like, oh my God, you're going to be like an amazing mom. If you, when I grew up, I didn't ever say that. I never said I want to be a mom when you grow up. Like, what do you want to be when you grow up? I was like, I didn't even know what to say when they asked me that shit. <laughs> I was like, huh? What's going to happen when I grow up? I agree. Um, <clears throat> you ever like you get frustrated from hearing from hearing them say that? Like, because it's sad. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, no, Jasmine, it didn't hurt. Um, yeah, I, sometimes I hold back, dude. I hold back a lot for my kids. It's like I hold back and I smoke more lately. It feels like that. The older I get. Yeah, it's it's hard out here in the streets. So we had a hard morning. I was like, fuck, I'm not making breakfast. I'm like, that's it. That's it, I give up. <laughs> I'm like, give me five minutes to get my life together. And then I go upstairs and then guess what I see? The upstairs of the Total paper. No, you remember the big things that they cut at five bowl that had a bowl full of candy? Oh big things. God. Both of them were all, there was like hella wrappers everywhere. There was the um, lemonade. Hands crushed, and there was a full one that wasn't even open, just laying on the floor. Oh my Jesus Christ, y'all better see, y'all better clean this shit up before your mama see it. <laughs> they all get up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Another thing. Oh my goodness. I am, oh, I am so mad at my kids for this. There's like no food, no <laughs> snacks, no drinks allowed upstairs. And what do we see in the morning? All the time. Food, snacks. And it's not baby snacks, okay? My daughter's food is not up there. It's teenager snacks. And I'm like, I know I that Dubby on. doesn't open hot Cheeto bags and eats them here. They blamed it on Dubby. There was I like, know. There was like I'm like, Dubby doesn't breakfast. get a lemonade soda or can and pops it open and just sits down here and drinks it and puts it down. Like, he doesn't do that. There's no way. <laughs> He'll maybe drop it and they'll be like on the floor, but he'll never like sit there and drink it until it's empty. And it was done last night. W was downstairs. <laughs> I put her to bed. <laughs> yeah, my kids are really bad at that. <clears throat> I feel like we're good with the educated kids. So, like, whenever I like get on to them, yell at them, or whatever it is, I'll go back in the room, like, five, ten minutes later when we both have, like, when the, like, whoever it is calms down, and then I go back in there, and I tell them, like, I explain to them why I got onto them, I explain why I got them in trouble, I'm not just gonna yell at them for no reason, and just leave them with their thoughts, because they don't understand, it's a life lesson, everything's a life lesson with the kids, so it's valuable to teach them what they did wrong, why I did what I did as a parent, so they can understand, and so next time they have a better understanding of what to do and what not to do. Mm -hmm. I think it's important, like, I feel like before, like, back in the day, like, we would get hit, like, we would get beat or something, but there wouldn't ever be, like, that explanation behind it. So, like, you grow up feeling some type of way, like, towards maybe your parents or something like that. I don't want our kids to feel that way, so I explain it to them. I'm not, I'm not just getting on to you. I'm going to start crying. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I'm like, stop talking about it. Uh, I, I go in with the fucking guilt trip. I, I run my household a little different. I'm like, I work so hard, Dylan. I work so hard for you guys. And all I ask is that you guys don't eat up here. I know it was you. Don't lie to me. I could tell it was you. I know you. And then he just looks at me and his eyes start getting watery. That's what I go in with, bitch. It fucking works all the time. I don't know how you feel about that. I don't know if you're going to call CPS on me. I don't know. That or pull I don't know. <laughs> I'm like, or you get this sucker right at this level. You have to hold it. Like, your back has to be real straight, bitch, okay? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, yep. Just make sure it's a light saddle because this thick as fuck is hard. <laughs> um, you do that, they'll calm the fuck down. They'll clean it instantly. I'm ah, just kidding. <laughs> no, but yeah, I do the guilt trip. And I'll like, 
be upset and I'll clean it in front of them. <clears throat> but while I'm cleaning them, cleaning it, they'll start helping and starting to do it. And I was like, you, it has to get to the point that I'm up here cleaning for you to help. Like everything they do, I'm explaining how it hurt my feelings a lot. And they, they look at me like they're so sad for me. So, <laughs> but they still do it. So I'm just like, I'm gonna go with option C now. I'm just gonna go. <laughs> Ryan was A, guilt trip was B, and the chocolate was C. Oh, you just still don't understand. <laughs> I know, just this morning I found a video when we were um, an RGV. Ryan was slapping <laughs> Pedro with the chocolate. Did <laughs> was, you delete it? No. I don't know. I, I was deleting a lot of videos. I was deleting a lot of shit on my phone. Yeah, I beat the shit out of Pedro with the chocolate. With, with his, his chocolate. chocolate. <laughs> And I said, not with his chocolate. <laughs> and then after he was done beating him, he got the squirt gun and he started, <laughs> he started spraying him and he was like. <laughs> My bad. I was drunk. <laughs> was so no, that was before we even drank. It was It's because so he got funny. me good right before, like before the like recording happened. What did he do to you? I don't he got remember. me with the squirt gun. Like, he really just randomly just started. Right my back. So I chased him, I caught him, I took his trunk lift <laughs> and beat him with it and then got the squirt gun and sprayed him. Yeah, it, the squirt gun was a hit because when you guys came back from groceries, I was like, <laughs> I started squirt, squirt gunning them. I got my ass beat with the bowl. The Damn. worst thing that I got beat with was with a broom. The broom is the worst? The, this not the actual where you broom the stick from the broom. No, my dad made like. And a, my my family is Mexican, so we don't have those cheap ass brooms. Oh yeah, the thick ones. Yeah. <laughs> my dad made like a thick ass paddle. It was fucking thick, and then he there was like a cut right in the middle. So, like, it was already pa past the point where, like we would laugh when we, we they we get spanked. So he made us like pull our pants down, and he would spank us on our bare. And that shit would pinch the fuck out of you every time you got hit. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. I hit I that would... bitch, he never found it again. I could never. <laughs> I put it in the, in the vents. <laughs> I hit that You were like, I'm done. It's over. I'm good, babe. You're good? Yeah, save it. It's, all, it's still a whole ass half one. God damn it, I can't see shit. <laughs> Extensions cord, yeah. I, I, uh, I've gotten hanger belt, hanger, the metal hanger, to fucking a stiletto one time. <laughs> stiletto, yeah, <laughs> with a smiley face on. Ah, I'm scared. Uh, I when he told me that he got hit by a paddle, I was like, Oh my god, my mom wasn't that bad. <laughs> What a, like, I'm like, oh my goodness. And back, like, over there in Texas, we, I would get beat by the principal. Yeah, the principal I, was I could not believe that in Texas that, that they're able to hit your crisis kids. I was like, what? I'll go home. I'm like, I shall work here. I'm just kidding. I'll go home upset at my parents. No, I'm like, no, I'm like, no, paper? I don't want to. I'm like, no, I don't want to do that. I'm like, no. They make you sign this paper. You say yes or no. The first time that they did, but the, uh, when I was in high school, they made you sign the paper. And my parents signed the fucking paper because I kept getting hit. <laughs> I was like, you fucking signed that paper. Like, you signed that paper? It's all a trust issue between the son and um, parents now. Oh my God, drama. Sounds like a soap opera. <laughs> was what my mom used on our bare ass. Oh, that sounds bad. I switched a switch on bare ass. <laughs> Pull them down. Pull them down. I'm like, no! I'm 39, but my brother would get spanked with a paddle. We lived inside, so it was funny. <laughs> oh my God. A thin belt. Oh, that shit feels like a whip. Basically a whip. Ah, somebody help. Um, we used to get beat so much that we made a game out of it. And I literally <laughs> love this for us. And I'm pretty sure some of you guys probably already played the game too. 
I'm gonna tell I'm gonna make everybody play the game. I wanna do like a barbecue and make them play the game. You so, make a TikTok out of it? <laughs> yeah. So basically what happens is one person gets a belt and you get the whole if this was our backyard when we played this game, bitch, it would be so real. So you go and find a spot and hide the belt. And the, all the people that want to find it are on one side of the house and they can't look on this side. So you have like like a minute to figure out where you're going to hide it. And then once you find a spot, you roll up the belt and you put it in there. And then you go back and tell them, it's ready, go, find it. And they run all over. And when you see someone that's close to it, you yell their name and say, you're getting warmer. And then everybody starts going to that spot. <laughs> one person finds this as everybody goes to that spot you start whacking whoever is close to you and your goal is to run back to your to, to the side of the house She's without fine. getting hit because let me tell you my sister would not go easy on this <laughs> my cousins my boy cousins they would smack us we would i would be so angry because i got smacked so much times that when it was when i found the belt oh there was so much anger built up bitch i was like oh, like as fast as i could and everybody's around you because everyone's trying to find it and everybody's looking at you because they're trying not to get hit so um it's intense <laughs> i'm gonna i'm gonna make anna play it i'm gonna no, make esmeralda play it too i'm gonna make esmeralda play it and we will make a tiktok out of it <laughs> i'm pretty sure i'm not the only one i have to not be the only one whenever everybody comes down here i'll make petra play it too <laughs> beat his ass <laughs> he's fast he's fast <clears throat> but i i feel like you guys can catch up to him <laughs> when he took off running he, he turned around and he saw me right behind him he's like, oh shit <laughs> i didn't know you were fast <laughs> um it's called oh. his daughter his daughter um hello cheyenne how are you my love fuck i've been out here for how long i need to go inside yeah. all right ladies i'm gonna let you guys go i just wanted to brag about my fucking life it's tough out here about us getting beat we ran it so deep i don't even know where we started i don't even know what we were doing i'm like what was the point of this conversation <laughs> i'm scared okay we have a lot of things to do apparently because we're making tiktoks now we're making a whole game now we have a, we have a whole schedule ahead of us. <laughs> oh no. Now we have to throw a barbecue party. I'm down. I know, me too. I love parties. I love barbecue. I love dancing. <laughs> I think you already finished yours. Yeah, okay. I forgot about mine the whole time we were smoking. Have a pool day. I know. I want to have a pool day. Today we're not. We're doing anything except I need to get a new phone, bitch. Yeah. It's, it's about that time. It's about that time. Be like, Bessie. Are you going to want the, the same size one or are you going to want the bigger one? I, I think the same size. I don't like change. You remember? If I could keep this phone today, I would keep it. No, you need the one. I don't know. I think I would be fine. My phone is teared up to the floor up. It's fucked up. The screen looks like an old TV screen. It's with the <laughs> and shit. The it antenna. Is. It is. And then when I get anxiety, I pick at it. I'm like, it's so bad. And Riley has oh the God. amount of videos I have found in my phone of Riley recording herself or taking pictures. Like, all you can see is her double chin. Um, or all you can see is um, skin, but you don't know whose skin it is. <laughs> And then all you can see a bunch of blankets no, or forehead. This, I'm like, uh, this morning was the fucking worst because she put it on flash, and then she'll <laughs> grab my head like right here, like she'll grab it, pull it up, and then she'll like take Breathe a picture the phone with the flash. Like, ah! So all this morning we were like seeing flashes and shit. I remember, she's tough. She'll sleep. She'll cry. And we'll get her out of the crib, and I'm like, okay, I'll put her in the middle of us, mm -hmm. and me and Ryan will both go on the ends of the bed and kind of like sleep like this. So we can feel if she's crawling on us, we can feel like she's gonna go over. So um, I'm kind of laying down, resting my eyes. I could hear her playing. Um, she'll open my eyelids like this. And I'm like, God damn. She'll put her finger up my nose so far where I'm like, 
like doing that, like sneezing. Bleeding. And I'm like, no, <laughs> don't do that. Be nice to me. And then she'll laugh. She'll laugh. She'll think it's funny and do it again right wh while you're saying it too. I'm like, oh my God. And I'm like, no. And I turn around and I go under the covers and then she thinks it's a game. She's going to pull the covers off. <laughs> You basically don't sleep for those 30 minutes that you thought you were going to add a little rest while she plays like quietly under the bed and waits for her parents to wake up. Fuck no, that doesn't exist. That only exists in movies. Mm -hmm. You wake up the whole time they're bugging you or pushing you or landing on you. <laughs> it's so bad. Like, it is so bad. That was our morning since five in the morning. I mean, since like three, three in the morning. Three. Three in the morning. That has been our morning. So twelve to three we gotta sleep. We've been up since. <laughs> I'm so sad. <laughs> Alright. I gotta keep going though. We gotta go cry. We gotta go cry first. I'm gonna go inside, we're gonna cry. You wanna cry first or you want me to cry first? <laughs> you want me to go first? I'll be quick. <laughs> And then um, I have a to-do list for today. It's not bad. It's pretty chill. I'm just so out of energy. Yeah, I'm not cooking this morning. Not today, Satan. I'm just kidding. <laughs> we got the um, dishwasher fixed, though. That's a plus. The guy came yesterday, same day. Super amazing service. I was like, oh, my God, this is amazing. Um, so... I'm thinking of cooking dinner tonight for sure. But we got pasta place, right? Yeah. But pans. It was so hard to wash the pans. That's why I was like, I don't want to cook. Mm -hmm. But we have a lot of breakfast snacks, like waffles. The kids, have, the kids buy a bunch of breakfast nuggets. Have you tried them? Fucking bomb. Fucking bomb. <laughs> It's like, what? Who invented these nuggets? And then inside of them is like eggs with little baking bits. I'm like, someone wait. And then you deep, deep fry them. Oh my God. So bomb. My kids are like, get them, get them. And they dip them in ketchup. Oh, bitch. It hits. It hits. I don't care what you say. It fucking hits. But yeah, they have other little snacks they can eat for breakfast cereal peanut butter jelly the basics i'd be cooking for breakfast i'd be cooking for them breakfast all the time and it's always like pancakes eggs bacon like it's always good breakfast so i'm just like just bear with me here for one day i, need, I haven't slept since three so i'm like can you guys make yourself breakfast <laughs> Oh yeah, the French toast yeah. ones. I love French oh, toast. All right, we have the munchies, and we cannot be eating because we drink our ketones. So no more talking about food. <laughs> Baby, we did it backwards. How oh, hungry? How oh, stressed? All right, ladies, I'm gonna let you guys go. Um, I'm gonna drink my rest of my ketones, and I have some errands. And hopefully, dare me, please dare me. I have to go to the gym again today. My legs hurt. My lower tummy right here hurts. I'm like, ow, it's, I'm so sore to do setups again. I'm like, I'm not gonna make it, you know? <laughs> but I'm like, I just went yesterday and I want to go again. So hopefully I get the courage. I think I can. It's just fucking hot out here, girl. It's so hot. Yesterday was 112. I'm like, what the fuck? You want to go to the gym and you want to get out? I don't shower there because I'm trying to race home because I can only leave the kids for like an hour. Um, my sister gets home and then she just got off work. She was standing all day. So I'm like, watch the kids really quick. I'm going to go to the gym. But I try to go really fast because I know she's fucking tired from working eight hours too um, on her feet. So that's why I'm like, go quick. 
I don't shower at the gym, so when I come out, I'm sweaty, and when I come out to a sauna, I'm like, ugh, ugh, uh, I feel like shit. I'm like, I'm about to have right here. <laughs> I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna throw up. I'm like, no, I feel disgusting. It's hot. Getting in the car, it burns. I'm like, ow, 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 ow. <laughs> Oh yeah, don't forget the AirPods. I won't. The AirPods. <clears throat> All right, friends. I love you guys. I'll see you guys later. Say bye, baby. Bye.